Bug fables. Now, I might be thankful for what? <laughs> okay, this game, on the other hand, is very quiet, so we need to turn it up. Alright. Okay, everyone, I'm going live now with a, with more bug fables. Still doing side stuff. Try trying to get ready to fight the Ultimax tank. Hee <laughs> hee. <laughs> Come hang out with me. Flutterbug. There we go. Now let's put that in the server in case anybody in the server isn't here who would like to watch. Alright, we good to go. Did I tell everybody on the stream the dream I had about uh, playing Earthbound and Ness having a shotgun? Did you did you all hear about that? <laughs> all right, what are we doing? Sounds familiar. Okay, because <laughs> I was thinking about it again. <laughs> Smash Bros. DLC, me Gunner Ness costume. <laughs> we should probably do this one. Oh god, the golden seedling. Really? Oh uh, well let's let's follow this one for now. I wanna see if I can figure out this one. Big Fables Explorer Check. After fighting against the commercial district, they run off. Now I can't locate again. In the first area to the south area of the section, you'll see a fence. If you know how to dig, use it. Oh, okay. I got bugs in this game, Bree. The bugs is here. One sec, everybody. I got a message, Cassie. <laughs> you forgot there was a cute bee? How could you forget something like that, Bree?
You have low amount of memory. Oh. <laughs> I was just talking the other day about, or just yesterday, about how I seem to have a pretty good memory. Um, in fact, I have a photographic memory. And then from there, I was thinking about how a lot of people take, when you hear photographic memory, you think like ultra memory. Like, someone who can remember like absolutely everything that has ever happened in their life, but like for me, it's not quite that good. And like, the only, the only requirement for a photographic memory is just that you remember everything visually. Like you remember things in like pictures or sort of like what you could call like video almost, <laughs> which is me. And I remember stuff that's from when I was younger than most people have memories from. Like I have memories from when I was about two or three. And I don't remember all specifics. I remember some random specifics. Like I couldn't tell you the exact date when certain things happened. I'm not... I don't have that kind of memory. <laughs> you just went to the Bug Fables wiki, Biss? Where the hell is this fence that they're talking about? There's no fence here. You have found the worst wiki comment thread in existence? Uh oh, is it gonna need... Are we gonna need to make a video? Cause you know, I start... I'm do... I'm... Taking up doing like... Rant-like videos. Well, not exactly ranting, but, you know, just unscripted, just commentary on things. It's just awful. Just awful. <laughs> I do want to, th I'm, I'm seriously considering doing a video on that Fantendo wiki stuff that we found, though. What a party poo poo girl complains somewhere else, grumpy face. <laughs> what in the world? Oh, I think I forgot to mention on stream, but anybody who watched that video, um, there was a part that I forgot, or that I, well, I didn't notice until um, after I was done recording and editing the video. Um. Um, was that one person, that one person who was, um, like, going on about how it was illegal and everything, also then said it was, quote-unquote, morally reprehensible that uh, Nintendo Life made that article. So, <laughs> that was a, that was a heckin' quote that I wish I had noticed. That was, I, that was wow. South of the Explorers Association, behind a gate, and defeat the... What gate? And what's the Explorers Association? Is it this building? Is this building the Explorers Association? I don't know. And what the, what the, gate? Where, what? South of, is it this building? Is this the Explorers Association? Is this south? Oh! I found it. You criminal dorks. <laughs> Let's just beat him up. Ooh. 
The answer wasn't to become criminals. God. <laughs> Can't believe it took so long to find that. Lap bugs. This is that is a, that is a term they decided to say, isn't it? Yep, here goes the beamerang. Oh, very good. Throws them both. Yes, I like this. Yes, I like this very much. Yeah, that's Ubis. Oh yes, also the other, there was another person uh, that I missed during the making of the video who was saying that, uh, was accusing Nintendo Life of also being too lenient, or like always defending ROMs and emulators and uh, claiming it's for preservation slash backup copies and it was like, but actually it's all just about um, piracy, which is bad. So, so Nintendo Life is bad. It's like, wow, okay. <laughs> it was bad for doing that. It's just wild, because these... It looks like... It's, <laughs> I keep thinking about... It's just like, to keep it in context, that this is just... This is a site that's just about Nintendo news, right? It's just about... Just, just games. And these people are talking... The, the way these people are going on about this is if this is some sort of... Well, I mean, obviously they're taking it as a moral issue, as a morality thing, somehow. But they're talking the way you would expect people to be talking, as if this was some sort of, like, political discussion. They're just... They're just talking about... <laughs> they're talking about somebody making a custom manual for a Nintendo game. <laughs> They, these are probably the same people who complain like they don't want politics in things. And then... <laughs> you know? <laughs> they're just they're being... they're so weird. These would probably be the same people who would yell that they don't want politics in their games or on their Nintendo forum. And then they act like this. <laughs> oh yeah, like the National Pokédex people. That's exact. Remember, I brought up that same thing. The same people who will complain that they don't want politics in games then make the most mundane nonsense into a political thing. No, the green bug's fine. Abu is fine. Whoops. <gasps> and remember, Biss? Remember, Biss? Oh yeah, you said they don't want quote-unquote politics around because it makes the stuff they say, the stuff that they whine about seem small. Remember that one part in the video I read where that guy was like, you think this is a big problem, wait until you hear about, like, a bunch of really bad uh, crime stuff. And then the person was back, like, like, listing those things off, like, what? Why are you bringing that up in this civilized discussion? <laughs> It seemed pretty civilized. It was just talking about things that you obviously didn't want to hear about by based on your reaction. He did. This guy's dead. It's only a matter of time. <laughs> yeah.
Yes. Yes, yes, I like this. Hey, Shan. Making me seem foolish breaks decorum, Chroma says. <laughs> Nintendo wiki one will be much more frivolous of a topic than uh, the first video than it did like that. And in fact, it will end with me, um, well, the whole point of it will be as a recommendation to go to that site and explore. Remember when you made up a, a Wallace and Gromit uh, social media uh, website, Bis? Where you can only comment using uh, emojis of uh, Gromit, and they're called Gromits. And then, and then you, made, you made a drawing of this. <laughs> you made a mock-up of what it would look like. Get hit by a stink bomb. <laughs> every time I hear of Wal every time that Wallace and Gromit comes up, that's the only thing I think of now, Biss, is your grommets. That's one of the greatest puns you've ever made. A lore book. Stuff is over here. This is a really random looking place. Leave your grommets down below. <laughs> Freeze a sleepy bug. Sleepy bugs are cute. Have you ever seen a sleepy bumblebee? I think there was a video of like a sleepy bumblebee being like brought back up to f to full speed by gi being given like a little tiny bit of, of sugar. <laughs> Gromit Pog. Oh no! I'm I'm about I'm about to do something terrible. Oh, Gromit is spelled with one M, by the way. Wow, nobody's ever made a Gromit Pog before. Need to play the Telltale Wallace and Gromit game on stream? <laughs> telltale Wallace and Gromit. The only Telltale game I've played is the Back to the Future one, which I got for free. Let's go check on the bank and see if we've made any any monies. I don't remember how much we had in before. It was definitely a hundred something. So if we were up to 200 or more, I would be able to tell that we'd made money. Okay, I can't tell if we have made money. <laughs> Hmm. 
Okay. Well, we're still trying to figure out how to fight that boss. Mosquitoes are strange bugs. They are... Crane flies around here, I often hear called mosquito eaters. They're typically called mosquitoes. I don't even know if they actually eat mosquitoes, but they're, we call them mosquito eaters. <laughs> Let me see. Do mosquito eaters eat mosquitoes? <laughs> they aren't mosquito eaters. <laughs> no, they do not actually eat mosquitoes. Also known as the mosquito hawk. Also known as the crane fly. I love that we often just get into just bug conversation during bug fables. <laughs> giant insects. Well, giants a little bit much. I wouldn't say they're giant. Resemble big mosquitoes. Despite their appearance, these large insects are completely harmless when fully mature. With mayfly, often confused with mayflies, crane flies, aka mosquito eaters, only live a few days once fully mature. Unfortunately, they don't eat mosquitoes or help control mosquito populations. <laughs> The larvae of crane flies can damage lawns, which is important to identify what these mosquito flies look like in order to prevent and remove them from our yard. They look like fat worms when they are babies. Adult crane flies do not bite or sting. What do they do? Do they do anything? What do they eat? It looks like they only eat when they're larvae. <laughs> they're liars, they don't eat them. <laughs> well, I haven't been looking at the at the chat. Oh, Arrow's here. Hi, Arrow. Oh my god. So many chat messages I missed. You don't believe a crane fly could catch prey? They're worthless. <laughs> fly like drunk two-year-olds. Wow. <laughs> Bumblebees fly around as if they are um, inebriated as well. Because there used to be, um, we used to have a, uh, there was a, we had a little birdhouse on the side of our, uh, at the last place we lived. Um, and bumblebees moved into it one year. And, um,. So or they were using, you know, the little hole of the birdhouse to, to go into their hive. Um, and we would watch them fly in there and they would like go back and forth and 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 like slowly line themselves up with the hole. <laughs> it took them many tries of flying back and forth to manage to get into the hole. <laughs> it's incredible. Bees at least stay away from obstacles. Crane flies are magnetized to every possible surface they could hit. Oh. Bees have yet to understand windows. Do you understand windows, Bree? Okay, Ultimax tank. Let's look at the strategy again.
Are you sure about this, Wiki? Are you really sure? It says, the soundtrack that plays during this battle, General Ultimax, who has a tank, references the name of the final boss soundtrack in Super Mario RPG, Smithy Who Likes Transforming. Are you sure that's a reference? Are you sure? It all, the only thing in common is the name of the character and then who. No, none of the rest, like if it was, if it was General Ultimax who likes tanks or something like that. Okay, then maybe I would, then yeah, that's a clear reference. But this is like, are you, that's a little bit of a stretch. So hello, Monaco. <laughs> and then we have according to the dev ultimax tank was based on general guy's tank from paper mario which inspires this game <laughs> the wording on that <laughs> okay has rather high hp and defense on both modes so kabu is very useful in the battle as his attacks pierces the defense. Alternatively, lower its defense with break or heavy throw. It has high freeze resistance, so don't rely on it. Since all of its attacks either hit all characters or hit multiple times, and feeble and or fortify plus are effective. If it charges up, use bubble shield, as the follow-up charge deals high damage to everyone even after cleanse. Frost bowling with at least one attack up can be useful in this battle, as it can one-shot a summon wasp and deal high damage to the tank and even freeze if you're lucky. So, let's see. I believe we have Enfeeble. Already. Yeah, we have Fortify Plus and Enfeeble. I feel like... It says and or, so I feel like we should just go with one of them. Enfeeble... Is good, and then because because we also want to do the bubble shield, and we want to have enough points left to manage to do both. If I have anything to buff B, I don't think so. So that wasn't listed on the page. So I don't. I haven't. <laughs> give her health <laughs> so we need items that um, give us TP. Okay, well, we do have that. The crispy donut is good. Well, we'll just go with this for now. Let's just, um... Let's just give this a go. Actually, why did I leave? So, V auto heals now. Which is pretty good, I think. Wait, why am I- wait a minute, this isn't where I'm supposed to go. This isn't right! I don't remember how to get to this boss. <laughs> Oops. 
Actually, that's not true. I think I remember. I go over here. Wait, we get to see the goth moth. Also known as the goth. <laughs> goth moth. Arrow, that sounds like you just gave Bree a command. To slash you. Chances inciting violence. <laughs> Biss, did you just say XD? Did you just say XD in my chat, Biss? What year are we living in? Two thousand three, oh, okay. Is it time to play Pokemon XD? Oh my god, I forgot to heal them. Awesome sauce. What is going on in my chat now? We've gone back to a time when Twitch didn't even exist somehow. I guess cheeseburger. Good old internets. Ye old internets. I love the sound of the submarine because it clearly sounds like somebody just going... <laughs> Somebody going. <laughs> it could be the submarine. Cat is afraid of blowing raspberries? Oh. Um, so where do I want to go? I guess just back. Back to it, I can go. He gets spooked by the sound. <laughs> well... She smile. What if I do the machine gun sound? If I can still manage it, let's see. I can still do it, yep. <laughs> Too powerful. <laughs> Bree says, don't shoot me. <laughs> Oh yeah, Biss makes banana pizza. There's a reference to Biss's banana pizza in Pizza Time Explosion if you can unlock it.
Good thing I noticed we didn't heal before I came here. <laughs> Sloshy bananas? Sloshy bananas? Imagine picking up a banana and there's it's like f like rather than being firm, it's just like full of liquid and you hear it you put it up to your ear and you hear it sloshing when you move it. I think I think that would be very disturbing. I remember when I was a kid, I always wondered why there was no such thing as banana juice. It's like, well, there's, there's like juice for all of the other fruits. Where's the banana juice? Did you know that bananas are a good thing to eat when you have a headache? That's what I often do when I have a headache. Oh my god, look, they're in the jail! Oh my god, I didn't know you were going to put them in here! When it's occupied by the wasps and everything? How cruel are they? How cruel are they? I can't believe they got thrown in this jail! Oh, we can't even go in there to, like, mock them. Oh my god, they got put in here! Yeah, bananas are good for headaches because they got lots of potassium, and uh, potassium's good for your brain. And your nervous system in general. Oh, I could have healed here. Whatever. I gotta sneeze. Uh oh. Okay. Successfully muted sneeze. <laughs> they exploded potassium in school one time. Yeah, potassium blows up or reacts very strongly with water. Reacts explosively with water. They never did that at my school. However, um, what they did at my school was make uh, carbon dioxide like. Uh, plastic bottle bombs. Science teacher would put um, dry ice in a plastic bottle and then detonate it. <laughs> and you could you could just hear it throughout the entire school every time we would do that. It was the thing you do at the end of the year every year. good I don't have uh, much confidence in this but we'll see oops I forgot to to look
it is enfeebled. Let's see, what were the moves? Heavy throw or break? Okay. I don't think I have those. Yeah, this thing has a ton of health. Yeah, I remember about the experiment where you'd blow up the plastic bottle with uh, dry ice. As I remember one time, I just happened to walk out the door because um, we had like a courtyard at the school and I happened to walk out the door into the courtyard at the exact moment it went off and just got blasted in my ear holes by the sound of it <laughs> just <laughs> just imagine an explosion just right next to your ear is basically what it was <laughs> incredible One damage. Okay, so what's the needle? I think you said needle toss earlier, Chroma? You're still there? Piercing darts. Needle toss, okay. Could have gone better. I like how Enfeeble just works. Yeah, that doesn't really help. stream brim a little bit for a second there. Frost bowling. Unbelievable. I thought I was able to one-shot the enemies. You lied to me! Wow, failing instantly. How about that? That's another thing that makes this so hard is because I often mess up the attacks. Ah, uh, there's no way I'm going to manage to do this. I think this is... I don't think I'm going to make it past this part of the game. It's just not going to happen. <laughs> God. Yeah, now he can't revive. I don't have any more... <laughs> I don't think we're going to make it past this part of the game. It's 
it's just it's just not gonna happen. I don't know why this boss is so hard. Like, I don't have enough points! I don't have enough of the, the, the toilet paper. I, I simply do not. And I invested in that constantly because of um, using the freeze moves. So I have like as much as I possibly could. Just about. just the I've got the medals that I've got the medals now that that the wiki recommended me to have but they didn't they don't help when am I missing I did I'm doing I'm trying to do exactly what the wiki tells me to do but I don't have enough points to keep doing the moves it needs me to do where am I supposed to get am I just, oh, I don't have enough inventory space to have enough items to keep the, the toilet paper and the health up enough to, to do it. What the... How the hell are you supposed to do this? I... <laughs> Okay, Arrow, thanks for joining. Getting brimbled and talking about toilet paper makes you laugh, Biss. <laughs> for me getting brimbled and talking about toilet paper. Yeah, Biss. Why do you want in, Biss? Not much is going on in this game right now. Actually, I don't need that. Hmm. Or we should enfeeble it again. really focus for this part, unfortunately, Biss. I don't think I can handle voice chatting with somebody during this. Another one immediately? That was good. Unbelievable. I should have done in feeble. I didn't know who I I didn't know who was playing. Enfeeble it.
probably go for the... Probably should go for this. Heal. Feeble. to yourself, Kabu. Bug tables? <laughs> Sorry I'm quiet, it's just I don't think there's a lot to say here, and I'm just trying to trying to survive. Chewing on licorice, Chan? Oh. Okay, time for bowling. Doing two damage every turn. This is gonna take twenty more than twenty rounds still. More than twenty turns. <laughs> God, how do you do this? Chat, I don't know how to do this. I think this is going to have to be one of these RPGs that I give up. It's just, it just doesn't work. It's just impo- I don't, I don't understand. <laughs> God. I 
I've managed to make V like nearly invincible, but in like the least helpful way possible. <laughs> If you can believe that. I don't see how I could do this. It's just... Just in time for me to be. Oh, I'm I got no healing. I've got no toilet paper anymore. You're here just in time for me to like give up on this game forever. And also, the bit rate is getting scrambled for some reason. I don't understand why. the other one I have about had it with this game this is the third stream of this game where I have tried to fight this thing and had no luck I've gone through so much trouble trying to do a bunch of stuff to try and make this boss doable. And nothing is helping at all. It just goes the same way every time, no matter what I try to do. I don't understand. I hate this boss. This is one of my least favorite RPG battles I've ever been through, and I don't like RPG boss battles to begin with. This is the worst one for how it makes me feel and how difficult... I mean, like, it's... I, this is the most difficult one. Really. And it's so hard to grind in this game. It's like they specifically go out of their way to make it so that it's you can't really grind. I've made it this far before, Chroma. This isn't this isn't unusual. I've, uh, this is the first time I did this. I got about this far. This has been... I've done this before. <laughs> Wow, that did nothing. Look at this! I hate this so much! The only thing I've liked, like, similarly to this, is every single boss battle in, uh... Uh, Octopath Traveler. Where every single time there was a boss, I would have to spend hours grinding to just barely manage to get past it. And it would just be, it would always be the same thing. It's like, do a few moves, then heal, slash recharge. Do a few moves, heal, recharge, and just, it was so repetitive. And the grinding, and just, just every time I had to grind for hours. God, I had to stop playing that one. God, I couldn't- I could not continue playing Octopath Traveler. Because every boss was like that. <laughs> Octopath was- was- was hell. But I- somebody gave me that game as a gift. So... I'm not too mad. 
I wasn't going to play that game in the first place. That's the only time I ever end up stop playing a game is if I didn't pay for it. It's like if I paid for it, well, it's like... I gotta see this through to the end. Well, actually, that's not even the case. I didn't finish Baba Is You. I didn't get very far in Baba Is You either before. Like, that game caused me, like, physical pain. That one was beyond the rest of these type of things. That was beyond how I feel in an RPG, where I was... It was, like... I had, like, a physical head out. Or, head out? A physical headache. Although, that's a weird sentence, too. Did you have a non-physical headache? A metaphorical headache? <laughs> Rigid Coffin, I guess. For our last skill. Oh my god. Well, that's it for Kabu. Which means it's still gonna be like 10 rounds in order to get this. Oh, it doesn't do any damage to him anymore. No, I didn't want to attack that. We can't damage him anymore. That's gonna take 28 rounds. This is impossible. Oh. <laughs> We're still not any closer to being able to beat that. a bit, I guess. If we can get maybe one level up. If we can get one level up, I'll be happy. It's just I don't know how, like... It also bothers me that I always, in the case of needing a grander plan to get through these things, it's just, I hate that I always would need a guide to figure that out. There's no way to figure out these things on your own. Like, how would you, like, first of all, oh, stream's out. Wow, thanks Twitch, still having this problem. Anyway, first of all, how so like, how would you know that those items are there and where to get them, right? Because they're pretty obscure. I've had to like really go out of my like I needed the guide to figure out where even to get where even remotely to get these things, and then like and then to figure out where you would need them, right? Like, I don't I get the the thought process. Like my brain doesn't like. <laughs> Do you know what I'm... Am I making any sense? I feel like I'm not even making any sense, but you know what I mean. Like... <laughs> it's just... Like... And then, like, one RPG series where I can do that in... To an extent, is Pokemon. 
but I spent like 10 years of my life like learning about Pokemon and getting really into it. It took me like 10 years to understand fully how those games work and to be able to just make strategies in it just on my own. 10 years. <laughs> and like and in every RPG is just like as complicated as that, if not more complicated. And it's like I don't have another 10 years to learn I don't have 10 years to learn every RPG, you know, like <laughs> to figure out where everything is and like I don't know how people do it. And yeah, Pokemon DLC I will stream tomorrow, by the way. Speaking of Pokemon. <laughs> Can you see what my item bag looks like? I sound like a video game Carl Pilkington. Oh, great. One sec here. Let me just finish this. <laughs> great. Just what I wanted to hear. Here's my items. I think this is what you meant, right? Just regular items. Let me go through that a little slower. <laughs> there you go. It's the best I could manage. <laughs> It's just, I hate this because, like, the rest of the game I didn't have trouble with. The rest of the game I did just fine. It's been smooth sailing for, like, 20 hours. And then, like, I've spent now, like, another 10 hours trying to figure this out. A key. I did one little cooking mission. Well, it's just every time I tried to cook stuff, I would just, it would just give me a mistake or something similarly bad so I didn't like <laughs> see the point was this just like a little shortcut and plus there's like hardly any inventory space to begin with oh that is a, a shortcut well that would have been nice to have had earlier, but I digress. <laughs> Cooking in Breath of the Wild was fun and easy. I didn't make mistakes most of the time in that. <laughs> How many metal points do I have? Very little. Not that it would help me, because the stuff the stuff that the guide, or like the wiki was trying to get me to do is all stuff that requires the, the team points. And I just, I don't have enough of those. They just run out too fast, and items don't give me back enough. Plus I need healing items, which also take up more inventory space. It's just, it's just a big mess. And like, the rest of the game wasn't like this. I made it so far with no problems. Like, there was a couple battles that maybe would take me a couple tries. I don't understand why it's like this now. I mostly invested in health and the, uh, the team points. And even investing in team points heavily the entire game, I still, like, <laughs> don't have enough for what I need them for. It's like, I wanted to like this game. Like, most of it was good. And, like, it was all smooth sailing. Everything was going great. 
happened. Let me see here. I have 14 metal points. Which doesn't allow me to equip very much. Most of the medals that I equipped were for overworld stuff up until this point as well. It's just at the point where I need guides or and or people telling me how to play the game, the game has failed me in my mind. <laughs> okay, sleep well Bree, thanks for joining the stream today. I don't have enough information to, to make strategies. Like, my only strategy I've had up to this point was just freeze everything. That was my strategy, it was freeze, and that worked great. Until they gave me a boss that you can't freeze. And, uh... Now, I, now, now this is happening. <laughs> you can't freeze, among other things, about it. That's why I invested so heavily in the in the team points was because then I could just freeze all the time. It was great. Everything was great until the the tank nation attacked. <laughs> and I only just stumbled into that as well because it was so cheap to do with the team points. <laughs> Like, that's the only game mechanic that I knew how it worked, you know, like... <laughs> Almost a level up. Which is better than nothing. I mean, making a strategy that is something other than just the moves you have is predicated on you being able to find and be aware of whatever it is that you need. And, like, it's really easy to not do that. So, like, <laughs> you know, like, that's what I keep saying. It's really easy to not be aware of the thing that would make life easier. That's what I got a problem with. Because, yeah, that's basically always how I feel things like this is like, how would I ever have known about that on my own? I just, I, you know, I just stumble into things at best. <laughs> and at worst, somebody has to tell me about them. Well, there's a level up. Uh, 
this is a hard choice because I feel like it's got to be metal points, you know? Considering that everything people have told me to do is involving metals. But then also the metals require the team points when they give you a new move. And then of course health is always good. I think we have plenty of that at the moment. Ah, uh, decisions. It's just, it's tough. Items are weak in this game. Every, everything's pretty weak in this game. <laughs> you don't feel very strong in this game. I think, yeah, I think metals is just... We got two bonus toilet paper. Well, it's better than nothing, huh? Items just, they just don't, you don't get a lot of space for items and they, each one doesn't do a whole lot. I can get, like the best item I have right now gives me 12 team points. And we go through those like that, like that's, it just 12 team points doesn't last very long. Maybe if I, if I could have like a million of those. That would be good. But I can't, because I don't have enough space. <laughs> Remotely that much. I Karma. Okay, Chroma, you, you had some th suggestion for me? I would like to hear it now. I'm just... such a loss. 26 hours of playtime, huh? How much does Steam say I have? Steam says 30 hours. <laughs> yeah, I think some of the time playing this didn't get logged. Good grief. Okay. They're putting favorite one in HP corn leaf. Yeah, Rubber Prison is a location in this game. Right, we are in Rubber Prison. So what is favorite one? Allies damage taken, but makes the rest of the party angry at seeing their friend hurt. Ang favorite one... HP core, so let's take it off of you. And, um, put it on you. I have one more point, huh? Think any of these are gonna help. Plus two per round when they're hit. Hi, bug. That's eight points, huh? Ah, these these ones are real the HP plus is very good. I mean it's only two though. But if I took one of those off, that would give me three points now. What would I do with those three points? It's Kabu Basic. Oh, you, oh, just his basic attack is what you mean. Gotcha. And then Needle Toss when they're angry would be stronger. Victory Buzz. Don't really need that. I don't think there's really anything that I could do if I got rid of one of those HP pluses, so I guess that's good. This is the best we get. Leaf would effectively be relegated to item usage. So 
So, do we abandon the enfeeble strategy then? But whenever I cook stuff, whenever I cook stuff, I just get stuff that stinks. I just get like a mistake or whatever. I did a mission that was about cooking and I got a couple decent things that are better than like the average stuff. But it's still not that great. Like I still like blow through it instantly because there's not much inventory space. <laughs> I talk to NPCs all the time. They don't tell me anything useful. Again, I mentioned this, and then this one I mentioned earlier. The point at which a game... The point at which I need a, a guide or I need people to tell me about stuff for a game like this. The game has failed me. Like, it has, it has failed. I shouldn't need that. <laughs> It's a problem with the game if I'm ending up needing people to tell me stuff or I need to go guide. <laughs> it's like it, it cheapens it. <laughs> well, let's see how this goes. I may need to reorder my people real quick, but... It's just, again, the inventory space is so small, you barely have room to experiment with stuff. Like, I don't know, like, how would you... I, it, it's just... I, how would I get enough things to experiment with? There's no... you don't have space for that. And then when I have something decent, I want to hold on to it, which gives me even less space. And just... <laughs> until I need to use it. Um, you need to go in the back, um, Leaf. The item storage service? The what? No, how do... I okay, the party order is very bad. I need... <laughs> Okay, so I want Kabu in the front, I want V in the middle, and I want Leaf in the back. How do I do that? I can... How, how do I make this happen? I've run into this problem before. No! Ka no! Is, this, is it just impossible? Is this not... Is it is my ideal layout here just not possible? Am I just gonna have to deal with this? <laughs> okay. Well, I guess we're just dealing with this because Leaf has to be in the back. Simply must. Wait, I forgot to, to spy. Well, you can spy next turn, V. Or you can spy. So now you do Needle Toss, and I'd better get good at this move. Well... <laughs> Great. Uh... You know what, I probably shouldn't. We want as many needle tosses as possible. No, I mean, how would I find these things? 
It's one thing not, like, to know, and then it's like, I would have had to find it as well, like... <laughs> It's really, it's really something. Let's see. Yeah, but see, I play this game at most once a week. I guess that's another problem. I play this game at most once a week. Sometimes there's longer between times I play it. There's no way, I, no way I would have remembered something like that. So that's, that's not the game's fault at that point. That's just me streaming is the problem. Angie. Hey, Arrow. Sorry, I've just been complaining about this this game and RPGs in general. Now I'm getting spumbused by the fact that, like, I usually like Mario RPG type stuff. Those are usually my favorite RPGs. Now I'm getting spumbused. Now, now I'm, now I'm, <laughs> now I'm, now I'm not enjoying so much. My God. I'm just going with what I was told. I was told Needle Toss. I don't know what either of those things do in the first place, so... Also, we're dying, Squirtle. I guess we go for... Succulent? It doesn't say anything about the defense thing, though. Oh, that says ignoring defense. This one doesn't. This one is more expensive, though, is the problem. I'm already... It's already a struggle to use the team... <laughs> the team points. Piercing means ignoring defense. Well, how would I know that? Especially when that one says... Wait, that's not who I wanted to attack. That's not... That <laughs> Great! Big waste of points. <laughs> oh. Great! That's great! There. Please do not die, Leaf. You need to get hit by stuff, but not die for this to work. I just barely made it. Oh my god. Yeah, I don't know what the hell piercing means. <laughs> that doesn't help me. Oh, great. Just what I needed. Just what I needed. Well, I have one of these. If only I didn't have to put V in the front. But I digress. <laughs> I'm just going to kill this thing. Oh my god. Oh 
my god. I feel like this is going worse than last time. Like we've like I've I've gone backwards <laughs> in how well I'm doing at this. Uh, we've got this. Be a good time to use that on V. Uh, well, we've well, Kabu's gone for good now. Can't revive him. Well, <laughs> well, that V's gone for good now, which means we're we're just we're done. If I get extremely lucky, we freeze the boss. For all the good that'll do. Well, oh, that's it. Yeah, we got farther last time when I was... <laughs> <laughs> Maybe I could do better if I just use Hurricane Toss from the beginning. Although, not right at the beginning, you know what I mean. No reason to waste it when it's not gonna be powered up. Also, we don't have to waste a turn spying this time. I still don't like this boss. <laughs> This one has been a real... This has made the game slow down to a real halt. I mean, I've been going through tons of trouble. Um... Like... To get badges, to like, do a bunch of stuff. Like, I've done like two entire streams of just side quests, just side things. And it's just, it's really slowed the game down to an absolute halt. It's lasted like another 10 hours. This has been like, this has been like the, like, about a half as long as the entire rest of the game. Just into, <laughs> just into trying to prepare for this boss. Like, it's ridiculous. I just, it's just baffling, because the, like, I had no trouble with the entire rest of the game. Like, here and there, maybe there would be a boss that took me, like, two tries. Maybe three, I think, in one case. Um, but that's fine. And, like, I felt like I was getting better each time, right? I didn't have to go and grind or really or anything. I just had to just do a little bit better at doing the moves or something. This time, it, <sighs> ten hours of... Of <laughs> preparedness backing me up, and then it still didn't really help that much. I still needed people to tell me how to do it better. And be like, here's a million things that you should have done that you didn't need to do for any of the rest of the game, and therefore, like, I had, like, and therefore didn't, like, I, <laughs> you know, like. <laughs> Well, well, see, the entire rest of the game, all I did was freeze stuff. That, like, 
that got me through like this just freezing things that was that was basically the only strategy I needed <laughs> I didn't need to do anything else just had to freeze stuff and then I win <laughs> but now I've been given a boss that you cannot freeze at least very unlikely to freeze Oh, stop picking on V. I didn't even want V in the front, but I don't have any... Obviously, I apparently don't have any choice in the matter. God damn it, V! V just took a beating. We're not angry, so we're just gonna attack this guy. God damn it! I gotta waste a skill point to revive V. Or waste team points, I mean. Alright, bail us out with some items here. Or with an item, I guess. Just my best yam bread. Here, V. Yeah, this is the third stream of this game I've done where I'm still attempting this boss. This is just what RPGs do to me. RPGs are just like this. <laughs> Unless it's Pokemon. I'm okay with Pokemon. But as I said earlier on in the stream, I had 10 years to learn Pokemon. God. The Angie. Again, everybody tells me you didn't cook answer thing. Every time I'm like, how would I know? How would I know what to cook? Every time I cook, I get just nonsense that doesn't help me. I get mistakes or other disgusting things. <laughs> yeah, I did that for a quest. I got the glazed honey from a quest. I did like an entire. I did two entire streams of side quests and got some stuff. Wait, why did I do that? Oh, whatever. Whatever. That did no damage, that's good. Everybody's dying. Squirtle. Healant. We heal in our sleep. That actually was slightly beneficial. Slightly. Getting angry in his sleep. Wow, look at how much healing Kabu got out of that. Oh my god. Oh my god, now we powered up times two. How did that happen? It like stacked because of the sleeping. What the hell? 
this incredibly lucky. Oh, except for now I can't attack that guy because he's too strong. Well, Frost Bowling will fix that. Holy. Holy crap. We might pull this out because of the sleep. I'm losing my mind right now, chat. Can't believe that happened like that. We, yeah, that was a good, that was a very good nap. Holy crap. That's my best healing I have left. A leaf? Okay, V, you're gonna eat a leaf. Eat that leaf and like it. Oh, good thing I fed her that leaf. Oh my god, I think we kill on this turn. Holy... I won on an absolute massive fluke. That never happened before. And Leaf is gonna get the kill! Hold on, we better use a skill to make sure that does... I'm not sure if that's gonna damage or not, so we're gonna... Yeah, let's, let's go bowling. This one's for you, Shan. What? Okay, well, we took no damage, but we get the power. Okay, well. Um. Well, we're still good. <laughs> we're good anyway. That that didn't work how I thought it would, but we're good. <laughs> I can't believe it. All those strategies and everything, and it was just getting put to sleep that that made us win. Wait, we didn't win. Wait, we didn't win yet. Wait, we didn't win yet. No, no, no. And he's dead. We can't revive him. I don't have any skill points anymore. Team points, I mean. <laughs> Uh-oh. Uh, well, we can get eight of them. Uh, he's still gonna... We have so little health, he's still gonna kill. <laughs> yeah, I could imagine you could die to the hand slap. Well, now my freezing strategy is probably good again. Yeah, it really is. Okay. Okay, well, we're good. We can handle this. That's okay, we don't need UV. Leaf will kill. Leaf MVP, as usual. I didn't use my... Didn't use my freezing strategy, but Leaf is still the MVP. <laughs> this isn't normal. We'll have to crush my body. <laughs> Leaf pulls us through yet again. Finally, progress. <laughs> I complained just enough times that it finally gave up and let me win. 
or it didn't give up more it just gave it to me with sleep <laughs> that, that that little power nap we took in the middle of there oh my god it's exactly like that one daydream i had that one time of like an anime scenario where like the one character just says okay time to take a nap and then just goes to sleep in the middle of the battle like what he's sleeping and they're just like flabbergasted and then wakes up and then wins the battle because just everybody was so flabbergasted as to why they were sleeping. <laughs> that exact scenario happened in that battle. We did the, the power nap. The true power nap. That's well, too bad Elfie isn't here. Elfie likes the little, the caterpillar. <laughs> Gracefully offered to protect the Ant Kingdom while we fulfill this mission. Make their final preparations. No bugs land. <laughs> All right. Oh, we're pl we're playing again. Well. Oh hey, there's a there's a tunnel now. What do you two have to say? <laughs> Break a leg. You're going to be famous? <laughs> Even now. Still rude. Is the caterpillar. All right. Well, I believe that accomplishment will end the stream for today. <laughs> I don't know if I can handle more of this game at the moment. I think that I think that was that was plenty. Pokemon DLC isn't out yet, is it? Here's not. Does anybody know what time that's coming out? I'm pretty certain that I'm just going to stream it tomorrow, and not today, especially because I have art to do. Yeah, I'm using the latest version. It says the 22nd, and uh, it currently is the 22nd still. <laughs> yeah. Don't want to go through there yet. Next stream. Next, don't let me forget. Next stream, we're gonna go back into like the the rest of the area and get items again. Cause I don't got. I got nothing. <laughs> I have nothing left now. I used everything on that battle. So next time I stream, remind me get items first. <laughs> go get items. And try cooking leaves, apparently. Um, so yeah, that was a... that. Just, I wasn't... You know, I didn't believe that I was going to make it past that battle. Not for a single moment. <laughs> there was never a point where I believed that I was going to win that. And yet here we are, that nap. That's a legend, absolutely legendary nap that we took. <laughs> the most powerful nap in the history of my stream. Uh-oh, I think I missed some chat messages. I was like, why is it so quiet? And then now now my chat room says, welcome to the chat room, which means that it just reconnected. So it was disconnected at some point. So if, <laughs> if you've been saying stuff and I haven't been responding to it, uh, that's why. <laughs> um... Yeah, that was... That was a, a thing and a half. How many... I wonder how many more streams of this I have left, because this was... This is already my longest, like, stream... series I've ever done. I think I was already at, like, part 16. I think this is part 17, which makes it the longest single game I've ever played on my stream. <laughs> wonder how many more streams I've got of it left. <laughs> 
I've had I've had several people tell me that that boss was the hardest one in the game, though. So we will uh, we will see if that is true. The filler arc is over. <laughs> uh, hopefully. hopefully, it doesn't take me so long to to set up for anything else in the rest of the game. Aye, aye, aye. Well, anyway, um, I'll be back tomorrow with uh, Spore, with Cassie again. I'm really looking forward to that. We're starting the tribe stage. Um, and I'll also stream uh, Pokemon DLC tomorrow after that. And then Saturday is going to be the Animal Crossing Halloween party with Ash on his stream. Um, I'm going to do my own recording of it, though, so you'll have that to watch on YouTube. Um, and then Sunday will be Biss again, and we will stream uh, Undertale and Wonderful 101, hopefully. Oh. <laughs> Lots of stuff to look forward to. Um, oh yeah, now that Carrion's done, next week I'm going to start uh, Castle Super Castlevania 4, and that's going to be a lot of fun. So, <laughs> thanks for watching today, everybody. This turned out to be a, a very entertaining stream. <laughs> Sorry, I had so much complaints. So much complaining to do. I'm not the world's greatest player of RPGs, clearly. But, uh, <laughs> I will uh, see you tomorrow. Okay, yeah, thanks everybody. See you then. Bye-bye.